There are a lot of great stories, and what a guy, I mean, and I don't say what a guy in a good way necessarily, because <laughs> Evil Knievel did probably more bad things than good, but, I, you know, as kids, we didn't know that. You know, we just, uh, we did, he was almost, uh, he was like a figurine to me. Yeah, yeah superhero, what, yeah. There's a story about a hockey team. Oh. I'll let you tell the story that is really unbelievable. Yeah, I mean, you could have done a whole documentary on Evil before he turned 20, but he started jumping at 25. But uh, at 19, he started a uh, semi-pro hockey team called the Butte City Bombers. And during the high, at the height of the Cold War, he convinced the Czechoslovakian national team to come to Butte and scrimmage his bombers. And they did. And they smoked the bombers like, I don't know, 22 to 3. And, but Evil went out between each period and said, you know, the Czech delegation is a lot bigger than we anticipated, and can you please pass this hat around so they can be comfortable while they're here in Butte. He did that every period. Uh, well, around the third period, he left the ice. And when he left the ice, that hat left the ice. And when they left the ice, all the proceeds from the game somehow got uh, taken from the safe. And <laughs> the, the, and the checks had no way to get out, so the U.S. Olympic Committee had to go into Butte to help the Czechs get out of... Uh, uh, out of this, Montana? Yeah, yeah. And they, <laughs> but they never caught evil. Uh, like, a lot oh, of things... Too fast. Got... He's on the motorcycle. Yeah. You can't catch him. <laughs> but he was so charismatic and so... And so he's very sharp and, and obviously a little shady. But they never, he would never get caught. He would, they would know, but they could never catch him. Did you ever meet Evil? Well, I had a chance to. Um, my, Matt Hoffman was getting an award for ESPN, and uh, he asked me and the Jackass, guy to, to, the Jackass guys to present. So we were excited because Evil Knievel was going to be there that night, our hero. And so I walk out on stage to, uh, you know, say a few words about Matt Hoffman, who produced this with us. And uh, as soon as we walk out on stage, someone kicks Wee Man from behind. He goes skating across the stage on his belly. Pontius comes out on stage wearing nothing but a thin belt. He's buck naked and doing a helicopter with his gym dog. <laughs> so I I'm just sweating through whatever I'm saying. And they immediately kick us out of the thing. They cut us out of the show. And Evil was not happy with us. And I don't blame him. By the way, if you can make a man who stole money from the Czechoslovakian <laughs> hockey team mad, you've Alleg accomplished something. Allegedly. Uh, the late great Frank Gifford is it, featured yes. in the documentary. Yes. He was somebody that Evil loved in, uh, in those wild world of sports days. Yeah, absolutely. There were, you know, my, my heart goes out to uh, Frank Gifford's family. And uh, we tried to get Frank to tell this one story in, in the doc, but he just wouldn't. You know, oh, really? Evil and uh, Frank, had, they had a lot of respect for each other. Uh, but at Wembley, which was the Wembley jump, which ended in disaster. And it was, the, uh, I think, aside from Caesars, it was the most he'd been hurt on one jump. And so he hits the jump, he goes flying. The bike ends up on top of him. He's broken his hip and some other things, and he's laying on the ground. Everyone's around him. He's like, oh, he's like, Frank, get Frank. And they're like, Frank, come over, Frank. Frank runs over, and he looks down. And uh, he looks, and, and Evil's like, Frank. He's like, yeah, Evil. He goes, can you do me a favor? Anything, Evil. He's like, can you get that broad out of my room? <laughs> 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 Well, you have to have a friend that'll do that sort of thing. Right, yeah. I am Jimmy Kimmel. If you like that, subscribe to our YouTube channel to get all our latest videos before they die and go to YouTube heaven.